In this video, I'll explain how to use a tool called Item Quoter to determine the duty cost for items shipped to the United States. To start, click Item Quoter in the left. Then you can fill out your item details. Start with where the item was made. Let's say this item was made in Canada. The ship to will always default to the United States in this tool, so you don't need to change anything there. Enter the item price and select the currency. Let's say this was 50 CAD. Then just describe the item that you're shipping. Let's say this is a women's cotton dress. Then click get result. The result will show you two free things. First, you get a free HTS code up at the top. HTS codes are used whenever you're shipping an item to the United States to let them know what is in the package. The second free thing you get is a duty calculation. Now duties can vary whether you're sending the shipment via a postal carrier or a commercial carrier. Here you can see the totals for each. Now it's important to know that these are just the duty and tariff costs. These do not include any carrier specific fees or import fees, so it's not a guaranteed total. It's only meant to give you an idea of how much the duty costs are going to be so that you can build them into your product prices or shipping costs up front if you're selling online. Duty costs can change. We've seen this happen a lot lately, so it's a good idea to come back and check this periodically. I'll show you this process one more time. Again, you'll enter the country where the item was made, the item price, and what the item is. So let's say this one was made in China. The price was 100, we'll say CAD still, and this is a leather bag. Again, you'll get that free HTS code up at the top and the free duty calculations to let you know how much duties will be if you send it via the post or the commercial carrier. It's that simple. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us. We're always happy to help. You can just click contact support here in your dashboard.